document this. Um, I'm waiting for my IVF coordinator to call me back. Uh, we are currently doing IVF from the title of the video. I did get the approval um, from my OBGYN. I have recorded a lot of our IUIs, doctor's appointments. Every single one has failed. I have never gotten a single positive pregnancy test, not even a false. Um, so we decided just to move on to IVF. So be on the lookout for baby Karika announcement, hopefully in the future. So anyway, enough rambling. I hope you guys enjoy this and I'll get more into detail about it in the future. So be on the lookout for that. Other patients who, who aren't, okay. who, who won't. Um, I think there are a couple of options for you. Okay. Okay. Um, as far as you know, looking at there's only so many ways to get pregnant, right? Mm -hmm. You've tried, you've tried your way, mm -hmm. but 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 the reality is, yeah, it's not. What we're not seeing is we're not seeing that there's a problem that's, that's suggesting that you can't get pregnant. Mm, okay. There's just something that's kind of a hurdle that things aren't getting over right now. Okay. We're having difficulty with. Okay. It's too early for this. It is nine o'clock, and we're on our way to my appointment. He had an appointment yesterday. Check. Well, this is going to be part of a vlog that's not going to be uploaded for a little while. So, hello to our future baby. <laughs> Mommy is about to go through paid for you. Kind of, maybe, it just depends. So, I'm getting my HSG test slash exam done today. Um, that's pretty much where they flush my tubes to see if it's blocked. They put, like, dye um, in my, you know, hoo-ha all up in there so I some people say it hurts and some people say it doesn't. I'm nervous for you. Are you? Yeah. I don't know if you can go in with me or not. That's what makes me a little nervous. I hope it doesn't hurt. But alrighty we'll see you guys when we get there. So wish us luck. Wish me luck. Nice. I don't know if I'm gonna be in pain or not so wish me luck. My baby. That was an experience. So basically they did the dye and that hurt for a whole minute straight. Like I was breathing as if I was like giving birth. This one had to wait in the lobby. So I had to go in by myself. And the verdict is my tubes are clear. I have clean tubes, everything looks good. So he said it is a process to get pregnant. You know what I mean? Yeah. So he was like, just be patient. But he did say we could start trying again. This is the one. You think? Mm -hmm. It feels a little different, doesn't it? It does. I don't know why. Hopeful. Hopeful. Oh, time's a charm. Come on. Number four, let's go. Not to stay. <laughs> Look, your mom is half naked. Stop. <laughs> your dad is still cool. It is time. Today is day one of STEMS. And you trust me? Well, yeah. This is my nurse. My fiance. And we're 
about to go to the section in the kitchen. We're about to do a step by step. We have to watch the video. Um, that the nurse. Okay, fine. Right. So we're doing stems. I already took my pills for the day earlier. And we're gonna go ahead and prepare the medication. So I'm excited. Here's our um medication medication station. We have hand sanitizer. We have um I follow stem bag. And then I have bandages, alcohol pads, these like caps and syringes, um all of these medications right here. The needles. And then yeah, we have the medication that's on the fridge from Fertility Institute of Hawaii. You <laughs> did better than I thought though. I'll give you that. You were a trooper. I normally never cry during shots. Like I've gotten pumped so many times. But like today they added a new shot to a regimen or whatever and she was like, it's gonna sting and it's gonna hurt and it like yes. put fear in me and I didn't even feel it. Like yeah. it was it didn't feel like nothing compared to the first one you did. Yeah. Like the first one hurt more. She said it was gonna sting a lot. It, it just feels a little itchy, like she said, but that's yeah. fine. Like, that's it. Well, I literally cried for nothing. <laughs> baby. Freaking out. I'm sweating. at a time, baby. Mm -hmm. She just got surgery and she's in a lot of pain. Mm -hmm. She's so sore. Mm -hmm. She gets really uncomfortable and if she's in a certain position for too long. Right? Mm -hmm. How you doing? Okay, it's hard to breathe. Hard to breathe? Sometimes. Okay, I have to be fed. Spoiled. You get spoiled way too much. Wait, I'm not dropping it this time. The first time he fed me jello, he dropped a big piece on my thigh, and it hurt so bad to laugh. Good boy. You know what? 
What shows? It's our first day of our official transfer shots. I look like crap, but I wanted to document this <laughs> for future references. Oh, we have to do this every day at 6 a.m. for the next eight to 10 weeks throughout the pregnancy. Not pregnant yet. We're almost there, and it's next week. <laughs> Let me help. <laughs> It's transfer day. We have been waiting for this day. It's got but it's been postponed so many times too, remember? So our official date was supposed to be September sixth. September eighth. September eighth, yeah. September eighth. And then it got cancelled. We're gonna go we're gonna go back to sleep for a couple hours. Get up around 8 and then I have to get ready and then check in at 10 a.m. So, see you in a little bit. It's transfer day. We're on our way to go get our little baby, our little embryo. From the igloo. From the igloo. <laughs> He's been in, he or she has been in Ice Age. Oh, I said he for the first time. Ooh. I've been saying she. I don't know why, but today I just said Whichever one I'm grateful for. Just so you know. We're on our way to get our little baby and I'm excited. I'm nervous. I keep feeling like I'm gonna cry. But I'm like, no, because I wanna take cute pictures because we have our IVF shirts. Mine says after this we're getting fries and it says IVF dad. All the emotions, all the worry, all the all the weight, IVF, hashtag IVF journey. We're gonna take cuter pictures and stuff. <sighs> I'm so nervous. It's like I'm nervous when I'm excited. Like I, I feel like it won't hit me until we get there, and I'm like on the table, and I'm like, crap. <laughs> so, we're on our way, and I'm excited. We're gonna show you pictures of our little embryo. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah. All right. Well, we'll see you guys. I know. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go and then I'm gonna enjoy my break. <laughs> I'm excited. <laughs> Whatever, it's been six days since I've had my transfer. Just woke up. <laughs> I look gross. I apologize for my appearance. Um, so I have been testing, call me crazy, since 
day three of my or after my transfer for some reason i don't know why i just decided to do um i started on day three i already expected it was going to be negative so i wasn't like bummed out i just i needed to get that out of my system and then i did day four and day five day four i did see a little line and day five i saw like more of a darker line so but those times I was like, oh, I'm not gonna test. I'm just gonna wait and then I already had my, my fresh morning pee and then when I decided to take the test I was like, dang, I don't have my fresh morning pee. So right now I'm holding my, my morning pee for dear life. Um, I have my cheapy for right now. I have a bunch of like, my good tests, but I'm waiting until it's like, you know, official official so um yeah i'm gonna go ahead and test and record because i feel like day six and past that is usually when you see like a blunt kind of line so i'm like super nervous miko definitely or luckily had to go to work all week this week except for friday which is our beta um and so i'm hoping for good numbers and yeah so i'm super excited and i'm nervous and i'm gonna go ahead and use the restroom Right back. Let's see. Okay, I'm officially like freaking out and not in a good way. <laughs> um, I was definitely expecting it to be darker. I know I still have like a few more days. It's just now I'm worried because on day four I saw like what I'm seeing today and then yesterday I saw like a darker line so I was expecting today to be a little darker but now I feel like it's going backwards and that freaks me out so I don't know maybe I'll take another one later okay let's just calm down and I'll check again. I'll take another test and I'll check again later. So this is not how I expected this video to go so far. sitting too long if that makes sense and now I'm cramping and I don't know I'm probably just gonna take my medicine and lay down and try again tomorrow I might try again later today but I don't know I don't know what to tell Nico because I don't want to tell him Fertility sucks. Okay. I don't want to lose faith though. 